Statistics Mean Values In statistics, a distribution refers to a collection of individual values. We're typically interested in characteristics of these values, for example, the range of values involved and the frequency of particular values or bands of values. The term mean is used to describe the arithmetic average of a set of values. This is often further simplified and called the average of a set of values. A general formula can be used to calculate the mean of a set of values as follows. It's given as x bar is x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus x4 all the way down to the last number you have, xn, divided by n. The term x with a line on the top, x bar, represents the mean or arithmetic average or average of the values. Each term in the form xi, x1, x2, x3, represents a particular value, the ith value, for example the first value, the second value, the third value, with n representing the number of values involved up to the last value, the n values involved. Expressions involving a lot of values can be expressed more simply. Rather than x1 plus x2 plus x3 and going on forever, you can write that as sigma, the sum from i equal to 1 to n of xi. So this symbol here is the same as all of that. And this is often further simplified to simply sigma x. The sum of x implies x1 plus x2 plus x3 all the way to xn. So in this way, the arithmetic mean of a set of values can be expressed as x bar is sigma x, the adding of all the x's, divided by the number of numbers involved. Example 1. Calculating a mean. Calculate the mean age of three people with the following ages, 17, 18 and 19. Well, we simply take the three ages involved, the 17, 18 and 19, add them up and divide by 3. 17 plus 18 plus 19 is 54. 54 divided by 3 is 18. And that shouldn't be surprising that the mean, the arithmetic average, lies between the lowest and the highest. It had to be between 17 and 19. It had to be higher than 17, lower than 19. So this number here, 18, appears to be correct. Example 2. Four people pool their money, contributing 5 euro, 10 euro, nothing, and 25 euro respectively. On average, how much does each person contribute? So four people there, one person who's broke, and one person with a relatively large amount of money. So we add the four numbers again, 5 euro, 10 euro, nothing, and 25, and divide by 4. 5 and 10 and 0 and 25 gives 40. 40 divided by 4, on average we have 10 euro. Again, this is between the smallest and the highest, but you know, it's not quite as representative as the last one because some people have nothing, there's quite a span, so only one person is 10, and some have values quite, a, quite different from 10. But we have calculated correctly the mean value.